guys welcome to day 4 of my karnataka ride from last two days i was staying in the city called as hospital but today it's time to say goodbye and head towards the new destinations that i have planned for my ride so today i'll be going to badami from there i'll be going to unesco world heritage site patakallu and vaya ayhole i'll be going to kudala sangama and lastly i'll be going to almati dam So after 2 hours of a continuous ride and 140 kilometers away from the previous destination I reached Badami. So Badami basically has a complex of a cave temples. So these cave temples were built by Chalukyas in between somewhere around 6 to 8 century. These caves are finest example of a Indian rock cut architecture. So if you want to witness the Indian rock cut architecture do visit Badami. So after parking my bike I started walking inside where I had to scan this QR code pay and start exploring the cave. So this is the glimpse of cave number 1. The cave number 1 is dedicated to God Shiva in the form of linga. So basically inside the cave there is a giant linga So let's go up there and explore the cave from inside. So one will need to approximately climb up 50 plus steps to reach inside the cave number 1. So this is inside cave number 1. After witnessing the linga from cave number 1, one, one will need to climb 64 steps and reach cave number 2 which is dedicated to God Vishnu. Since I had already read that cave number 2 is identical or similar to the cave number 1 I did not go inside the cave number 2 but started to walk towards the cave number 3 after climbing 60 steps Cave number 3 is also dedicated to Vishnu and it is the largest one in the complex I'm now walking towards cave number 4 which is dedicated to Tirthankaras of Jainism. Opposite to cave complex is a museum separated by a man-made lake called as Agastya. I'm now heading towards the other side of a lake to have a closer look of the Bhutnath temple. Wow, I wasn't expecting a entry like this. The hill what you see on the other side are the cave temples we just now came from there.
Kaba River. We are now 23 kilometers away from Badami Cave Temples and we are heading towards Pattadkal, which is also known as Pattadkallu. After lunch, it was now time to witness a UNESCO World Heritage Site Patatkal, also known as Patatkalu. Patatkal is located on the west bank of Malaprava River and just like Badami Cave Temples here, it is a complex of 10 temples, 9 being a Hindu temple and 1 for dedicated for Jainism. I am now 10 kilometers away from previous destination and the next one will be Aihole. Aihole.